many, many miles east of nowhere lies the amazing land of Oz, a magnificent empire created in the mind of a man who wrote a great book about it. Like wildfire in a wheat field, the fabulous tale of the Wizard of Oz spread from town to city to nation to the entire world. Although the Wizard of Oz has captivated the children of four generations and fired the imaginations of those youthful adults who have never grown old, although 10 million copies of the book have reached eager hands and eager hearts, no one has dared the towering task of giving life and reality to the land of Oz and its people. Every delightful character of L. Frank Baum's classic is now reborn. Every glorious adventure has been recaptured and painted with a rainbow. The celebration in Munchkinland, the flying monkeys, the rescue of Dorothy, the castle of the witch, the palace of Oz, and Dorothy's strange journey to the Emerald City to find the wonderful Wizard of Oz himself. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. We hear he is the wizard of winds, if ever a wind there was. If ever a weather of winds there was, the wizard of Oz is one. Because, 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 because of the wonderful things he does. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz.